Hi guys, it's Sam. Um, I'm going to do a 12 by 12 layout for you. Um, my voice is still a bit croaky, so you'll have to bear with us. Um, I'll be using a chipboard piece out of the Studio G Valentine's Day um, pack. I'll be using these red Flock Alpha stickers. I've had these for ages. I think I got them from our local pan shop. I'm using some letters from these A to Z rub on transfers. I'm using some of this pretend foliage stuff, which I've had um, in a cake decorating set, and I thought it would look good with my flowers. I'm using that. I'm using some of the the mini red roses. That's the chipboard piece out of the. It's a little ladybird. Um, I've made these flowers. They're a bit like carnations. Um, I just cut out a scallop circle. I think there's eight, eight in each. Um, and I've like cut them out, spritzed them with water, um, scrunched them up into a bowl, left them for a few minutes, and I've unraveled them and then I've like brushed red ink all over them um, and then you put a brad straight through the middle um, and you just gather them one by one and like scrunch it and scrunch it till it's like a little bud and then you just gently prise um, some of the leaves away like the petals away and you end up with them so I've made three of them some of them's more ink, I think this one's a bit more ink than these two, and this one's smaller. <sighs> that green stuff's all over the place. So I've got three of them. Um I've got a doily here, which I've um I've run my ink red ink pad across just to give it a bit more definition against the paper that I'm gonna use. I'm using my mind's eye magnolia paper. So so these are the papers I'm using. It's just a, a red and this pattern one here. I've basically cut an inch, well, half an inch all the way around, just to mat it. So I'll quickly glue that down. I haven't done any 12 by 12 pages for a while in this paper seems massive to me. So I've got that down there. Um, I'm going to put this doily about here. Um, I want the bit where I've caught it far too much with the red behind. And I've got two photographs. They're a little bit smaller than four by six. It's our river and our red dress <laughs> the other day. So I'm going to quickly just glue this down. I'm just going to glue the middle. All the little bits keep falling out because it's not totally punched out. Um, just trying to guess whereabouts I want these photographs to go. I'm not mounting these photographs. I'm just sort of putting them on an angle. I'm going to have to glue under this bit here. Yeah. 
Right, I've got these green things, it's going to go down here. And then I'm going to put me flowers here. Now I'm going to put my little ones. I'm doing them in threes. Um, got my hot glue gun ready. I'm seeing hot glue. This is actually a cold glue gun. Well, low temperature one, it's called. Right. Right, so that's stuck down. Fluff them up a little bit. And then I'll get me little red ones. Well, these are just red roses. And I'll stuff them. It's the only thing I hate about glue guns is the long string that they leave. Right. And my little ladybird. I'm not sure where I'm putting that yet. I've got it on some grease proof at the minute so I can just move it about. And my title is going to say Little Lady in Red. Like the song, Lady in Red. I was going to say Little Lady. So I've got a rub on which is Little, which is just out of a big pack of random words like graduation, party, fun, little one, uh, little one, congratulations. So I've just cut the little um, and I've got two tiny little ones to sit in. So if I do I'm not really a fan of rub ons because I either move them Oh, it doesn't come off properly, but I don't trust myself stamping the word little. I tell you, I've just moved it. No, it's still not complete. Right, so we have little. I don't know whether to have it straight underneath or to the side. I think I'm going to have it underneath. 
Ah, fudge. Uh, no, 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 no. I've lost it when I need it. Right. Try again. Yep, oh, I've just realised I'm off screen. This word in is really going to be tiny. Right. This should be interesting. We'll pop it up. Yeah, I was nervous about these ones. Is that you cut them out that little, you can't keep a hold of them. No, oh, it doesn't want to work. No, it's not. I can't get the... I can't get it to rub off, so I'm going to have to use... Stamps. Horrible rubbons. Now this end stuck here where it shouldn't be. My black ink. Should be fun if I make a mess. Um. Oh well, it's the best I'm going to be able to do. Right, and I should have stamped that in a little bit. Oh, actually, I need to move these up. Just so that in doesn't look like it's floating in the middle of nowhere. Um, I'll put that ladybird here. And um, that's it. 
that's me, 12 by 12 page. You can't really see the doily very well. There's the flowers and the, I don't know what this is called, foliage, is that the right word? Um, so that's it, that's me 12 by 12. Hope you like it and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks guys, bye.